Hello and welcome to Watimer channel. I'll continue playing Noita. Let's see what we have here. Spar balls, bombs and toxic sludge potion. But we will change that to water. For sure. Let's see if we can find an egg. Invisibilium potion just laying around there as well. Okay. Water tunnel is covered by dirt. So you will not get water from it. But at least it looks like we'll have a wiggling egg yet. We will be able to go on a worm and then use its blood to get increased vision. And possibly successfully explore the caves on the left side and in the ground. as much health points as we can. Just with spell refresher, but we haven't used any spells so. It was not useful for us at all. But at least we have found water. Let's make more of it. Let's get some water and continue exploring the left side. It looks like it's a dead end. Something just happened there. Let's see if we can use this barrel to make a pass in the cave. Oh, it was dynamite throwing zombie. So he just took himself. And we have acid monster there. Sludge. At least that monster is in a close box.
and we have found more water. We will be able to fill this portal. We have some toxic sludge here as well. With some oil below. And extra max health points. Let's see if he can throw us a dynamite stick. Very good. Space closed for us, but we can pick it. Okay. It's a dead end. Well, let's go back. We haven't found any weapon yet. Here's something. And it looks like it's a it's a toasty egg, I thought it's a fire rock. A toasty egg will be good as well. got ourselves a new friend. Three of them. To be exact. And the weapon is closed in the tunnel. Let's see if we can fight against him. And we have reached a weapon, and it has Circle of Thunder. Not very useful, because we don't have a good main weapon yet. Ambrosia Potion. And another weapon over there. And 
extra max health points. Let's see if we can get to it around. can hear fire monster as well it is a box near a item and that's a fire rod but I don't really need it let's just leave it for now and another extra max of points we'll have 175 Here we have polymorph fine potion. to it later. And here we have burst of air and another fire. Monster, but he's in Toxic Sludge and he's not damaged by it. Strange. And that's how we can take care of it easily. Try to move this box. To that side. Or maybe we'll find a barrel. I mean, here. box it will work down as well. Maybe let's use his barrel. Ooh. 
Almost worked. Let's see if we can get around maybe. A wooden wall. And a dead end here. But we might try to hopes. Make a hole. Try to move these barrels closer to that weapon to retrieve it. Let's try one more time. And now I will use a bomb. This time it worked. And we have fireballs. Okay, maybe let's change it instead of bombs it does some damage to terrain so we should be fine Here another fire monster. side of the Slava lake, but I still don't have a good weapon. Only this 
simple sparkle. Another teleporter. It. Here we go. No, it's a dead end too. Well, I could try to go to the next side of Lava Lake and successfully come back I would use some rosy potion. That might work. Or invisiblium potion. Let's hope you'll find something good. First I will refill my water bottle. We would have 200 health points fully healed. Do we need to drink it? Now it will be poisoned. Maybe let's use him with the bullion potion. But we need to fly on us as well. Maybe it will last longer than the Prophecy Potion. succeeded very good and we still have 93 health points I think it's the best run health wise I've ever had So now we can try to go to the left side caves. We still have a worm. I think it will 
be a dead end there. Our pet is here. And another teleporter. And a lot of oil. And we just accidentally killed our pet. I can see an acid monster. But we killed it easily. This one tried to do that as well. But if we successfully reach caves, we can fully heal ourselves back and even have 100 more health points than at the beginning. bottle. Yeah. Try to surround me. And they try to do that again.
this town. And another one. Follows his lead. We are left with 35 health points. We have a cave nearby. So let's try to go deeper now. And explode the wall of the cave again to remove some water out of caves. Here's a thin wall. to keep his barrels for along the wall See if you can drown him. That will work. Let's move this barrel down the cave. Or maybe this will work as well.
have one more here. empty some water out of that cave now we only need to find a good enough place to deal with the worm ideal place would be maybe teleporter but not this one because it is filled with water and I need an empty one if I could have enough warm blood have increased vision for long enough to explore that cave. We are stuck again. We should be able to walk soon. extra max health points so if we fully healed we would have 225 health points now Let's see, maybe we will be able to find that health refresher with our firebolts. I think it will be a hard task. Let's spawn the war. But first, I'll cover myself in a prosia potion. Let's find a good place for it. So, a worm wouldn't reach it. disappears very fast.
and he disappeared as well. Oh, he tried to get us from behind. Close, so. Let's wait a little bit, maybe he will return again. But it looks like he will not really just drink that warm blood. So that should be enough. But now he will try to kill us, of course. not a problem for us. And we might even try to kill him near this side of the caves. We would have increased vision to go back. But the path is pretty straightforward. Let's start exploring this side. Giant lamps. Flying wizards. Creatures like that. That's a concentrated man. And it looks like that creature is stuck. If we damage it, it drops bone dust. Maybe let's fill this portal with concentrated mana, so we could destroy steel if needed. And now let's try to go... up to the... maybe even to the surface. We haven't been in this cave for a long time before. We have some extremely dense structure. 